My name is John Thompson and I'm a professor here of communications. So I've spent much of my life to date working on mobile phones such as this. This year, in 2014, I started as a coordinator of the Advantage project, which is funded by the European uh, Marie Curie programme. And this project is studying smart grids, and that's looking at how we can make future power networks much more intelligent and energy efficient than they are now. So in this project, in order to do that, what we've done is we have some people like myself who are more uh, into communications, have knowledge in that area, and then we also have people who are in the area of power engineering, so they understand more about how the power grids function and about energy efficiency issues. Within the project, we have researchers from four countries, so from the United Kingdom, from Serbia, from Denmark, and from Spain. And what excites me about the project is that we have a chance to do a dialogue to discuss problems in both communications and in power engineering and to understand the issues and the problems that uh, both communities face. If the project is successful, then what we hope to do is that we can develop technologies that can contribute to the future smart grid and enable this concept become reality. Uh, my name is uh, Dr. Charlie Kerala. I am currently employed as a senior engineer at NEC. We're looking at architecture and standards for LTE. Previously I was uh, a member of staff as a research associate with Professor John Thompson at the Edinburgh University and through our international collaboration with other uh, uh, academic uh, and university around the world we came up with a small team uh, of four members who together put together the idea, the successful idea of the Advantage project. The Advantage is targeting two different groups, usually separated the power system and the communication system, and we are hoping to bridge the gap between the two and work together towards a successful research outcome in the smart grid area. My name is Deep and I'm from Nepal. <clears throat> I did my bachelor's degree in electronics and communication from Purvansa University, Nepal. And after that, I did my master's from Finland, Tampere University of Technology. My specialization is wireless communication systems and circuits. So for the time being, I'm engaged with the Advantage project. I'm recruited in this project at CTTC, it's in Barcelona. So in this project, I'll be basically working on the signal processing stuff to enable the power line communications in the medium voltage grid. My name is Alexos Kudaras, I come from Greece and I did my first degree in Greece. It goes on electrical and computer engineering. I did my specialization in electrical energy and power systems in Aristotle University of Thessaloniki and my Master of Science thesis works on smart grids and electrical vehicles. My name is Mr. Josic and I'm from Sarajevo, from Bosnia and Herzegovina. And now I'm working in uh, Schneider Electric in Novi Sad in the in Marie Curie framework. I graduated in 2009 at the Faculty of Electrical Engineering in Sarajevo and between 2009 and 2014 I was working as teaching assistant on five different courses and in the same time I have researched electric machines as my main research object. Uh, most of the time I researched switch electrons machine and central machine and machines with permanent magnet and I graduated on master studies in 2013. My name is Anna Fagidaki. I come from Greece. I studied the electrical and computer engineering at the University of Patras. I specialized in the field of electric power systems. Then I did my master studies at PFL in the program of energy management and sustainability. And after that I saw the opening for the position in language and I thought it was Cool idea to be the smart grid engineer and specialize in both electric power systems and communications. And so now I'm based in Seville, working for the University of Seville and Endesa, one of the main Spanish power distribution companies. And I'm working on the topic of treatment, use, and values of smart grid data. My name is Mehdi Zainali. I come from Iran. I did my bachelor degree in electronics engineering in Iran and uh, I worked for several years as an R&D engineer and then I decided to continue my education in communication systems, then I moved to Sweden 
Uh, I did my master degree in wireless communication at Lund University. My name is Marko Milicinski. I come from uh, Macedonia. Uh, between February 2011 and May 2014, I held the position of junior researcher uh, at the wireless networking research group, which is based at San Cyril and Methodist University in Skopje, where I obtained uh, both my bachelor's degree and my master's degree. My name is Achilles Tsimoyilis. I am from Athens, Greece, where I also did my master in NTUA and I was working there as a junior researcher. Uh, right now I'm pursuing my PhD in uh, CTTC Barcelona with an advanced project. Um, I'm Mia Momuda from Japan and I did my virtual master in information engineering, especially in wireless communications. And now I'm, um, I'm working on uh, uh, reliable wireless communications of microgrids as a PhD fellow at Colbo University in Denmark. Hello, uh, I'm Haralakos. I'm coming from Athens, Greece. Uh, I joined the Atmantans project uh, as a Marie Curie early stage researcher uh, in the promising area of uh, machine type communications for smart grids. Uh, I believe it's a unique opportunity for me to perform research in this cutting edge uh, research field. Uh, as for my background, uh, I received the diploma of electrical computer engineering uh, from the National Technical University of Athens and the master's degree. Uh, in wireless systems from the Royal Institute of Technology, KTH. Uh, currently, uh, I'm working at CTDC Barcelona uh, while pursuing my PhD degree in uh, Polytechnic University de Catalunya. Hello and hello. I'm Alexander Vastilovic. I'm coming from the University of Novi Sad. I was born and lived in Sarajevo, in Bosnia and Herzegovina. I finished my studies, Diploma in Engineers Levels and Master of Science in the University of Sarajevo. I'm Pierre Fografenk, I come from France and my background is in electrical engineering and computer science. I have an engineering degree from Superdeck and an MSc from Herbert Watt here in Scotland. Hi, I'm Gautam. Uh, I'm an electrical engineer from India. I've been involved in a lot of environmental and climate change activities doing that. Um, because of this passion towards environment and climate, uh, I decided to take a master's in sustainable energy technology from Netherlands. Over the course of time, I grew more interested in smart grids, having my background in electrical engineering and also my interest in renewable energy. And today I'm part of the Advantage Marie Curie program, uh, focusing on smart grids again, uh, working with a lot of like-minded people and experts in this field. Mm, as an early stage researcher, I'm working with Flexitricity, uh, it's the first uh, smart grid companies in the UK. And at the same time, I'm doing my PhD at the University of Edinburgh. Uh, over the course of three years, I'll be uh, getting more involved in the services of Flexitricity, uh, trying to contribute towards more dynamic and real-time uh, demand-side management. And in, 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 in long term, um, I'm, I'm sure being part of this program, I can learn uh, much more than uh, just a PhD, going beyond the barriers and constraints of a PhD program, uh, trying to see what's happening in the market around me, uh, and at the same time, uh, making a good impact on the people around me. I mostly joined Advantage because I think that will be a great and excellent project. Uh, the reason that I believe that is because it, is, it constitutes uh, a mixed research network of power engineering and also telecommunication research teams that uh, are going to work all together on smart grids. And during this year I applied an advantage project because I find that it's a very interesting topic for me and now I'm moved to be part of this project in Novi Sad, the University of Novi Sad. Uh, in before I came on Advantage project, I was in the area of um, ICT technologies and network security and communication security in general. But in, uh, when I start reading about this project, I find that this project is uh, very interesting and a very modern topic. This is chance to collaborate and to find very interdisciplinary knowledge between communications and power engineering 
So this is some kind of new point of view on our technology world. Uh, to get involved in this Advantage project is a quite a good opportunity for me because I have met a lot of people here. There are, we are 13 years old and all of them are creative. They are a kind of professional in their field. So it's always better to have a creative mind around yourself. So I think this project will bring a lot of benefit to the society and it will and I'm sure it will add a new milestone or say a uh, new dimension to the concept of smart grid. I do believe that the interaction with uh, auto power engineers, uh, students from uh, other fields, it will be beneficial for me to get an overall view of engineering since smart grid enables different kind of technologies to be integrated uh, for the best result. Um, since Smart Grid uh, uh, integrates both power and communication en engineering domains, uh, it would be a great opportunity for me to learn about a uh, different domain and to be exposed in other research fields uh, which might be interesting to integrate in my own uh, personal research career. Actually, I'm really happy to join this um, um, training school, Advantage Training School, because I just did my PhD last month, so um, it's very nice to you know to know each other, you know other PhD students who also studied in these few weeks, and uh, it's nice to have various kinds of lectures from professors from other university or the. Uh, great researchers from uh, companies so I think it's very great uh, starting point of my PhD study. Uh, this is our first training week with the Advantage project. I was able to meet a lot of new people and that has been really helpful to know the people I will be working with in the next few years, uh, what they're interested in, what they're going to do and also find potential collaboration and partners for my secondments and for my career later on. This week we had a training program that it was very interesting. Uh, it's given me the opportunity to know the other people from the other universities and institutes, the companies. Uh, and uh, during the next three years they will be my colleagues and we will collaborate in this project. Uh, so uh, I think that mainly I will work on communication systems on smart grid and because of that I had that now a network with the other people that working in the same topics, not exactly, but in the same topics and I think that it, it will be a good opportunity that I collaborate with them. So I am very happy that I am uh, a part of this project. So, and I, am, I think that it will be a boost up for my career ahead also as a researcher or say in an academic field. It's a good opportunity probably to me. I find it very interesting and a very good personal opportunity for me that many industrial partners are involved in this program and many institutions also. The research topic of my PhD is uh, design uh, novel uh, communication strategies for control of microgrids, which I find it quite exciting because it's new for me. And I hope that besides being able to do some good research with an advantage, I'll be also be able to make new connections, new collaborations, and uh, I'll bond all new friends. This is, uh, this is great opportunity for me, for my career, and uh, in, in, this in this meeting I meet all remarkable young, young people, and uh, the Marie the Curie has advantage because uh, all, all of the people included in this, in this program can uh, exchange uh, experience between themselves. We can learn new things together, we can, research, we, we can do research together, but we can express ourselves on a unique way, unique way, yes. And yeah, I, I believe now dream comes true. This is our first touch here in this, this meeting. It's really proof that I made a super good decision, personally and professionally, of course. So, I really hope I will enjoy the next period spending time with these people.
This production is brought to you by the University of Edinburgh.